Welcome to Rome. Today I'm going to show you how to navigate your way through the Rome Airport. The Rome Airport, also known as Fiumicino International Airport. I can't pronounce it right, but it's abbreviated FCO. It is the main airport in Rome. I'm going to show you how to navigate through here in order for you to get to baggage claim in order for you to get to ground transportation, taxis, Uber, or waiting for someone to pick you up. You see this sign right there, Esutia, Usita. Did I say that right? Probably not. Someone correct me, please. Well, that means exit. So you wanna look for those signs right there, and if you follow them, you will surely find your way out of the airport because that means exit. All right, so getting off of the airplane and then just following uh, the signage down the road, move on down, move on down the road. Right here it says baggage claim. Now a lot of the uh, signage, Usita, you see that right there? It means exit. A lot of the signage inside of the Rome International Airport is in English. So if you know how to read English, then you'll find your way out of there. So right here I'm making my way out and into the main lobby. This is like one of the terminals that I'm in, as you can see right here, the terminals. And if you look towards the center, there's a kiosk. So if you need to transfer, uh, you can look at the kiosk right here where it shows you the arriving, departing flights right there. If you come up to the screen, you'll see that. And at the top, it shows you an arrow, Usita, exit. And it also says transit and direction to the baggage claim. Transiti, I believe that's how you say transit in Italian. Uh, it shows you how to get to the transit, and I'm going that way. Along the side, there's more kiosks that show, show which airplanes are coming in. Now, this is a relatively large airport, so you're going to find a lot of things in here that you wouldn't normally see at smaller airports. There's a lot of helpful things, like the kiosk, Every now and then the screens, the big screens, you want to look up because you'll surely find the big screens that can help you guide your way. And the sign is Transita Connections. Okay, Transita Connections. All right. Uh, it sh shows a pointing arrow. Now look at this. I, I saw a foosball table. Some people were playing foosball, so I came in to see what's going on to see who's winning the World Cup of foosball. Well, maybe it's not the World Cup. Uh, now, on the middle of the uh, hallways, there are, I wouldn't even call them escalators because they're not going up, they're just going forward. You just get on them and just keep on going down the road. Now, you don't have to get on these, you can actually just go ahead and do it by foot the old-fashioned way, which means you're not being propelled forward. All right, you can see right there, people lining up, waiting to get on their plane to nowhere. And there are plenty of stores, convenience stores, located within this airport, FCO Airport. Look at their people having coffee. Seems like it's early in the morning. Sun is shining. People are shining. And I'm going to see what's going on over here. Now, this is a cafe. I'm not exactly sure what the name of the cafe is, but it looks like they have something good going on right here. This looks like 100% authentic cheap Italian pizza airport pizza it's not really cheap but probably the quality is not as great as something you'll find on the streets of Italy this is Peroni that's an Italian beer you can choose from uh, to go along with your overpriced pizza that you'll probably find at the airport but when you're hungry and you don't have many options that pizza may taste like the best food that you ever had in your life now, there are other options like cannolis and other Italian treats you can choose from, but I'm not going to spend much time like on that. I'm trying to get my way out of the airport and see the real Italy. Italy, Italy is how you say it. People having drinks, perhaps they're having Peroni on the side before they catch a flight. I'm not quite sure. But look at that. Look like some beer that they're serving and a spoon, coffee. Now that's a big thing. A lot of times you go to some of the coffee shops in Italy, you'll see people drinking coffee standing up, not having a seat, standing up. Now when they do this, 
you'll know that most of the people who go to coffee shops and are standing up at the bar are actually Italians. That's what Italians do. They stand at the bar instead of going and having a seat most times because you're getting charged for sitting down extra more so than you would if you're just coming for coffee. So if you're just coming for coffee, just want to get your coffee and get about your way, you probably want to go and stand at the bar. That way you don't have to pay for the charge for sitting down and dining in. There's a charge for that but you can avoid that by standing at the bar. Italians know this, and you'll typically see a lot of Italians standing at the bar and not sitting down unless they're having some sort of meal. All right, so we're looking at the signage. Usita, exit, that's what it means. You see there's a picture and a signage for baggage claim. I'm gonna make my way to the baggage claim. Now, this is a relatively large airport because I've been walking quite some time, but Italy, things are big, right? Look at the Colosseum's huge. It's a huge stadium, even for this time. It's a huge place. All right, so I'm going to keep on walking, walking, finding, following the signage, and I make my way to another hallway. Now, this seems like this airport never ends, where, in fact, it may seem like it does never end. But trust me, if you find, follow the signage that is located above your head, keep on looking up. Don't look beneath your feet because where you need to go is not beneath your feet. All right, so look up, look at the signage. There is a train system right there. You can see that. There is a train system. It says baggage claim. Go ahead to the left. Usita, left. Usita, down. Baggage claim, baggage claim, baggage claim. It keeps signage never ends, but it's directing towards the right place. And with faith, eventually you shall get to where you need to go. Keep on following it, following it, keep on going down the road. Nice escalators right here. Some people choose to take the steps and take it the old-fashioned way. The lady just pulled up a peace sign and peace that guy out saying, no, not today. I'm not taking the old-fashioned road. Just take the escalator and get down to where you need to go. And she is off to the races. Now that she's on her feet using the old-fashioned way of walking, making her way following the exit signs. Now, there are a lot of signage, so you want to pay attention just so you know that you're not you're going the correct direction so it can be quite confusing but in order to get to your baggage claim you have to go through customs i cut it off for security reasons not supposed to be recording during security so i cut it off made it through security now i got to baggage claim got my baggage and now after this try to find my way to the exit of the building when I get to the exit of the building, there will be Ubers waiting, there will be taxis waiting, loved ones waiting, and people holding these signs for very important people. Am I a very important person? We'll see. Just taking a look at the coffee machine, and then there's a snack machine to the left of it. Pretty high tech, pretty cool features, new features that I have not yet seen before. A lot of snacks inside. Gonna keep on rolling. Keep on rolling. Almost made it to the Usita. Now you want to check for ATMs. Now there's ATMs all throughout the building, but you may go past it if you're not looking from side to side. There's ATMs as you can check. There is more signage of where to go, and it seems like this is going on and on and on. But you know what? I'm in here for the long run. So I'm sticking with you. We're going to make it to the end. We going to make it. All right, so looks like some construction is going on. That's why you see the plaster on the walls right there with some temporary looking like signage. And there's more signage talking about where the exit is, and I'm just going to keep on following it. Following it and following it to Careport, whatever that is. Just made it through customs. Now it's the last leg of the trip, which seems to be lasting forever. 
but we'll make it to the end at some point. Hmm. Maybe won't. Look at that. Fendi Roma. Fendi. Fendi Fendi. I guess that's an Italian brand of clothing. Signage on the wall. Showing some of the great features that Italy has to offer. Some of the ancient ruins. And I'm going to make it past the lovebirds on the right. making my way down the hall. And going and going. Making my way stellar. And all right, now it's telling me baggage or wherever. All right, so I'm gonna cut forward from this right here because this is, you know what? We made it this far, I'm just gonna keep on until we get to the end because it's coming towards the end. After that long journey, it seems like we've ran like two marathons in the course of this video, but it's all worth it because that's how you get to the end. You keep on going, you keep on going, more kiosks on the right. As it exit Esita, Esita, I think I said that right. Beyond those doors is the exit of the airport. Now, to make it through here, you have to pass the gauntlet of people, and it says limo, parking, airport shuttle, bus, train, and taxi. Taxi includes include. ride share. You want to get outside, ask people where to go for the ride share so they can direct you to the right direction. And we're making it through those doors, security on their cell phones, making sure that they are up to date on their Instagram reels so that they are informed just in case i don't know why they're on instagram i don't even know why they're on their cell phones but i guess it's part of their safety protocol people holding out signs to let you know that they are here to pick you up making the way out to front and this is the outside of the airport where you can pick up shuttle taxis ride share yada 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 people coming to pick you up and that's the tour through the International Airport in Rome. Hope this was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.